day one, Shacklefur Creek, Marble Mountains, here we come. She doesn't know the difference between a lake and a creek yet. Suki, you ready to go? You ready to go? Ooh. Ooh. Here we go. Shackleford Trailhead, Marble Mountain Wilderness. Here we go. Just saw our first bear on the trail. Thank goodness for Suki. She alerted us. But it was scared and it ran. So we just came to a sign where you could split off and do a Campbell loop or go to Log Lake. Uh, we're going to go try the Log Lake and then uh, see how, how that is. So far, awesome. Uh, not too much snow. Two bears so far. Let's see what's in store. Say hi, Locked Up. Hi. Well, somehow we missed Log Lake. So we're going to go left to Campbell Lake. Well, maybe we didn't miss Log Lake. Maybe we found it. There's definitely logs. It's beautiful. What do you think, Locked Up? I didn't miss Log Lake. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, my hair looks funny. <laughs> so we're at Log Lake and um, it's taken us roughly three hours from the trailhead. So this is a mental note for us. Here we are in a meadow right above Log Lake, maybe a quarter mile. Okay, we're at the split. We're gonna head towards Campbell Lake. We've been walking across a lot of snow. It's possible we got a lot more snow to cross. Well, we lost the trail. It's way too much snow. We're gonna head back to Log Lake, set up camp. We had to cross Shackleford, so we got a lot of water in our shoes. Gonna go dry out. Well, we made it back down to Log Lake, drying our shoes out after having to cross Shackleford. It's like a little mid-shin deep, water right over the top. Walking in slushy boots. Suki's wore out. Just uh, using some uh, lunch. Lunchtime, we got our camp set up at this nice stump. There it is, Suki, our tent. Locked up. She's already eaten. How's your food? Delicious. Ooh. Well, when you can't hike up any further and you come back to Log Lake and you get to play gin rummy with this as the view. Badass. It's about 5.30. It's a good time for a spot of tea. Hmm? So, of course, my fuel ran out while trying to boil water, which is cool. 
because I want to try out this. Uh, I got this uh, this little thing. It pops open, and you can use the smaller butane cans without your pot like not being stable. They just snap open, lock, and I'll show you how they go on. So you see, I've set it there, flat. The smaller cans fit into the first rungs. Huh. Drop your sporks all over the place. Boom. Stable fuel. Now back to tea. Boiling. That's good. So I got this from some snow melt. And I don't really want to drink it without boiling it. All right. Time for a little bit of peppermint tea in my trusty Humboldt Bay Coffee Company coffee cup. Yeah. Shout out Aware. Feed Riders Unite. And everybody get ready to bounce. Camp life season. Well, it's tea time, and not much sun left behind me. It's about to go behind, I can't remember the name of the peak right now, um, maybe Stewart Peak, but this, I got some peppermint tea. It smells good. I'm tired. We hiked, uh, we tried to get to Campbell Lake today, but uh, after we crossed Shackleford Creek, which is uh, it's kind of wider up there. It's a little shallower, but um, there's a lot of snow, and, and the water was deeper than both of our Gore-Tex boots would allow. So uh, my squirrel friend's like, "You in my zone, fool? Get out my zone!" But I can't right now, man. I'm 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 filming. Anyways, we uh, we crossed to go across. Both of us got water in our boots like all the way up and on the other side was like three four feet of snow um we couldn't find a trail after a while and didn't want to be stuck somewhere with wet boots trying to make camp in the snow so we hiked back down to um log lake and i couldn't be happier it's it's beautiful here we've seen just one other couple that were was uh backpacking they were trying to get up to cliff lake and they also had to turn back um, probably the same place we did is is just gnarly hiking in the snow without snow gear so uh, I'm gonna enjoy this tea locked up is taking a nap so for me uh, it's just chill time um, and get ready for the night time but check this out and look at that peak up behind me it is beautiful here and it's all to our own there's there's no one here at this lake the people they went back down the trail I, I don't know where if they were just gonna hike back out they said there was other camp spots but uh cheers to that cheers to our own private lake all right i finished my tea i'm gonna try to read a little bit of this black spring by henry miller oh magnificent It's the end of day one. Good night. Good night. <laughs>
Well, today we're going to hike up to some meadows north of Log Lake, and um, Locked Up's going to take some photography pictures, and I'm going to try to do a sketch of that rad mountain. Back in the same spot we were at yesterday with a day hike. Say hi, locked up. Hi. Yesterday here is where we crossed and got our boots all super wet. So maybe we'll find a better trail today. We don't have our big backpacks on either. So good luck. Well, we're kind of bushwhacking. Gonna do a hairball spot. Been hiking on snow for a while. Sketchy and steep. Can we do it? Dumping out the old water out of the boots because there's a lot of snow up in them hills. We're gonna make our way back down to this beautiful valley and have lunch. Right, Locked Up? Yep. Well, so we ran into some fellas when we were coming down the hill, two guys and a kid and uh, we saw them yesterday, late, trying to get up to Campbell Lake, and um, they made it. Well, they made it this far today, and this morning they went up there to try to fish, but they said there was a foot of snow across the lake already anyway, or still, anyway. Um, so I'm kind of glad we didn't carry our big backpacks up there and then have to camp because our boots are soaked all the way. We would have to stop and start a fire and dry everything out. That would have been kind of a nightmare. I'm glad we got, we stayed where we did, and this day hike was pretty tight. And uh, shout out to Luke, Luke's joint. We, we ran into him out here in the middle of nowhere, and uh, he went on up. He's he's doing it. So yeah, I can't wait to see your pictures, bro. Stop. Hammock time. I got kicked out of the hammock. Locked up. She's a bully. I'm a hammock bully. Beautiful meadow. Super wet. Huh, Suki? Super wet? Locked up? Yeah. But super pretty. All these corn lilies starting to come up.
as my dreads catch on fire. That would be rad. Ooh, look at that. Yay, locked up. High five. Yeah. <laughs> Finally took my wet shoes off. Wet socks. Gonna dry my, my wet feet off for a minute. Put on some clean socks. Pump up Republic. What up, Jason Brandy? I'm gonna slip my comfies on. Ooh. What are you eating? Pasta primavera. Is it good? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, beginning of day three, it's a nice brisk morning. Gonna get some spring water and uh, boil some water for some tea. So, even in the two days since we've been here, the snow has melted so much. This is all snow melt. I'm still gonna boil it, but super duper convenient. Throw a pot up, throw two pots up. Easy easy. Oh yeah, a couple minutes till some yummy, yummy tea time. That was a pretty lake to stay by. No, no swimming or anything, it's cold water man, it's probably just a big old snow puddle. It is beautiful. Kind of hard to see, but there's tons of baby salamanders out here. Just sunning, doing their thing. See right there, it's making the rings. Little mini monsters. All right, we dumped four pails of water on that fire, so it's out. Out, out, out. Don't leave your fires going. Pour water on them, lots of it. All right, all cleaned up, ready to go. Say bye, Locked Up. Bye. Say bye, Log Lake. Bye, Log Lake. <laughs> Too late. Find some water. That's the way to do it. So much water coming out of the mountains. Huh. On our way down. Pretty meadows, super green. Suki loves them. Well, just about made it. Woohoo! Marble Mountain Wilderness. Okay, we made it, and this is our made it back trip. Cheers! Ooh, cheers! Salut, baby! Yay! Yeah! One out there, so don't go there. But you should see my peace in the east. Cooking rice and beans in the east. Don't burn that in the air, kid. They breed hustlers. Short attention span, no shortage of customers. Hardest workers in the world. Car services, park ad purchases. Cop that right there. That's mine. I wrote worse, come the worst here. Those were my best days before my worst fears. Before headquarters, rest in peace. Spend a week up at DND. D &D. Yeah, I found it, New York, none live -er. Got work to move, my dogs are cab drivers So many heroes passed at ground zero Damn, y'all, we found it That's right We get busy New York is still the same Don't you knew how we do it And I'm from C-A-L-I-F-L-Y Representing West Coast, West Coast Yeah, the best from the West Born from a queen in the East God bless your soul, rest in peace And I'm from C-A-L-I-F-L-Y no fear, no love, no pity, where everybody's attitude is shoot.
on the trains and listen in the hood where the mixtapes bang no snatch a chain if you're not where people never sleep the sun could always hide the place where odb and scott la rock ain't die no they still alive through the sounds of the street violate and get your ass beat yeah i rep the west cause i'm from out there still on 8th street or broadway cop in a pair if you're asking me to choose the two don't compare you still find me anywhere